YouTube, YouTube, what is up? I want to bring you a quick video. Got two pickups. None of them are for me. Just helping out. Let's get into the first one. It's the LeBron 16. Got the box over here. Bottom. And there you have it. Let's see. Oh, got the glare going there. There you go. LeBron 16 Limited. And size 11. And it says uh, women's 12 and a half. Not used to that. I already seen them, but they're still dope. Woo! Here's the first shoe. Let's see if I get up close. You can see it a little bit better. Using the computer, so eh, it's not gonna be the best of best of quality. But uh here you go. Okay. That glare up in there. See? The LeBron 16 with the black swoosh. LJ got the gold embroidered right here. This is uh, like a glossy black here. Blue laces. Got this like Bordeaux tongue. Just like the Bordeaux 3s that just came out today. These came in the other day. Uh, these I guess are for the uh, Cavaliers color. I don't know. That's what I think. The upper is like a uh, um, I think there was a release that came out, the, the 15s, it was like same up or prime knit, uh, or what is it, fly knit, this is fly knit, I, I just what I got confused for, with Adidas, um, you got your fly knit upper, is what it's looking like, uh, blue laces, it's dope, there's a lot of colors, it, it goes perfect with the, uh, what the theme, the only thing is I don't like the the toe cap, I wish it would have just went all out instead of having this icy blue out. So, yeah, I wear sneakers that have icy blue out soles too, but I don't know, it just feels like it just incompletes it to me, and that's why I wasn't sold. I love the gold here, um, it's got ridges over here, then over here it says. It's backwards. I can't really read it. I don't want to take forever. Yeah. Might be numbers. I think it's looking like numbers. Need a mic, uh, freaking microscope thingy to look at that. I don't know. It's freaking crazy with the gold glaring. It's crazy. Um, also, it was dope. You got the shiny, uh, glossy uh, LeBron Duckman right here. Uh, he just gets lost in there. You know, you can't even really see him fucking crazy um design uh but yeah this is the first shoe and it comes with um the neon laces as extra right here the inside has a neon blue and neon and blue uh lj crown and you got 23 16 slash and red and you got a black in sole with a gray lion gold eyes here. Just try to give you a visual. I don't know if you'll be able to see it. It would have been nice to even just try. There you go. So, could have just done that. But whatever. <sighs> and when the hell were these made? These were made in, yeah, from um, March. 21 till 8.03, so until August, um, that's a lot of months, it's like four months at least, uh, making the shoe, I wonder how many pairs they made, I'm wondering if this is a um, soft release and they're going to make a bigger release, I don't know, this is um, my opinion, oh you got the LJ23 old logo right here, shit, look at that, that's dope. Let's see that. Nice pull tab. Sneaker looks dope. I love it. I just, I'm trying to find the right colorway. Um, this is a fucking fire colorway too, but like I said, this, this here. And I have other what does. And this what the is fucking fire, but I don't know. This just told me off. Oh, my gosh. 
and it's on both shoes too. And I like this uh, animal print here, right there. Got this gray with um, like a uh, multicolored, like that one is. The whole upper is multicolored, like that 15 that released last year. Um, you got that shiny gold with that blacked out heel and the gold eyes right there freaking staring you down and it's got some kind of iridescence to the gold because I see some kind of green bluish hues you got your blue fading out to red outsole it just goes from like an orange red to a yellow and then milky in the middle, black to icy. Uh, I just feel like this one is a little eh, incomplete. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. They could have done more. Like we went crazy on that one, and it's like a toned down one. I don't know if there's two LeBrons. We got the tone and the crazy. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. You know, this one has a line and the lines in the back. I really don't know. Whatever. Um, this one says, "I promise." On the back, I like how the uh, tongue sits like that. It folds, folds like this, and then you know you don't feel the tongue at all. It's just it's a, it's a weird design. It's it's nice how it folds like that. I've seen the um the one Adidas that they've made and it folds like half over here and it's a weird ass shit. This one, they've done a a great job of folding it. And giving it that that look, you know. But I don't know how these look on feet. I bet they look fire, and I'm gonna be pissed. And then you got your your speckled midsole. Let me get a close up on these shit. See right there. And then it comes with an extra set of laces. You got your red, black, and that one. And that one has a blue and black. Um, that reminds me of LeBron 12. What the? He had the one upper where that was red, the other one was blue. That one seemed incomplete too. I wish it could have done more in the upper. There were some spots where you could change the colors, but it is what it is. It's I-L-R-J-S-F-G. I don't know what the hell that is. And then they have an, a throwback. I'm sitting in the crown of the line. I don't know if you can see it. Let me try that. Yeah, shot right there. See that. So yeah, that's it, man. That's the shoe right here. Fucking fire. I like it. Mm -hmm. They're doing this one really nice. I like it. He's been doing a collab, so you gotta figure he might do, do another collab. I don't know if Brian's gonna do one with him or somebody else. Or was it John Elliott? You know. mm, this here looks like. Since it comes down, you're going to get heel creasing. Holy shit. Man. That's not a good look. No. That's not a good look. See, you can see that shit. Heel creasing. It's going to go down. This one looking like it won't give you heel creasing, but that one will. What the hell's going around with this? Let's see what the hell... Yeah, that shit came down further than it needed to be. That's why. But he wanted to get the whole line on there. That's why. That's why. That's not good. No good, no bueno. But it does look fire. And if you're just going to have it, it's just... I mean, it's vulnerable. I'm not saying that you will, but it's vulnerable to getting here. All right, enough of this shoe. Let's move on to the next one. Oh, a re 
retail was 200 items. It's not bad. And they used to, I think, 220, 225 for uh, those limited ones. Real quick, these are 700. This is for my brother, Naeem. I already got these last year. The easy supply. I thought about uh, getting a double up, but I don't I'm enjoying I am enjoying my pair and knowing what I know. Those will release again. And I'll buy them then when mines are destroyed. Because I am destroying them. Oof, I freaking love them, man. I might buy a used pair here and there. Somebody will beat them up and I'll just destroy theirs. So hopefully they ain't faulty. Got a little bit of, uh, so you can see right there, a little bit of threading issues there. But that's only on the toe box. The way I get rid of that is I get a lighter. I'm not doing it to his pit. I get a lighter and I burn those gray threads off. You know, try not to fuck up the upper lip. That's my trick. That's what I do. And then it just burns the ends. It's really nice. I really love this sneaker. When I first saw it on Kanye's feet, like, was it um, a year and a half ago? Uh, the midsole had more of a, a wave going to it, but I guess uh, the way the paint and all the, the whole shit mass produced wasn't going out. He changed how he wanted it to, um, the midsole outsole to look. Um, but yeah, no, these are fire. I love the sharp line. I'm almost glad that he left it like this instead of the other one. But I do like both. I don't know, whatever. I do like this. And when you look down, it's got the sharp angle coming down. You know, you got these lines. Here, it's freaking fire. I don't know. Fucking fire. Side looks fucking awesome. Love putting these on. Yeah. The heel support right here. You know. Cushioning, another level. But yeah, I just love it. The the color blocking. Um, the only thing is, when is he gonna release more color? Because you know what's happening to this one. The Yeezy 700 is basically moving on. Um, I don't know. They're just gonna make two colorways. Um, but yeah, it's moving on. They're coming out with uh, Yeezy 700 V2. And then a V3. So he's coming hard. And he just showed pictures. No, he actually show, had him on. First, I saw the uh, picture that he was on um, underneath the train tracks. And then he did a video next to uh, Kim. And he was showing him off the Yeezy basketball sneakers. Those shits look fucking fire. My God. So, yeah. I'm going to need those. Those look... And it had the um, the toe cap like this. So he's bringing this vibe into the other ones. And that upper is sick. Um, got the 3M hits here in, in the, the netting. And then all in the heel. Just fucking crazy. It went from um, everybody wanting glow-in-the-dark shit. Now he's just bringing fucking a lot of 3M. And... Good that it ain't where fucking in the toe cap where it'll crease up like, you know, you've seen many fucking Jordans. They do all 3M upper and then right here, as long as he doesn't do it, just little subtle hits here and there, it'll be fine. And on the uh, medial and lateral sides of the shoes, it'll be fine. But, um, but yeah, uh, can't wait for those. And, um, uh, yeah, uh, the leather quality is on... With about the same, it feels about the same. Good on the second run, yeah. Uh, as far as this one, doesn't have the strayed uh, phrase of uh, of them. A little bit over here on the black part, black suede here. But yeah, no, these are fire. Fucking level. Yeah, glad I was able to help. Our right, YouTube. We want to show you. Peace.